Welcome to my channel. I have decided today to do two bonus videos because I finished my series on Randy Travis yesterday and I've not begun a new one. And so I'm going to do two bonus videos. You get two for the price of one. Before we do that, I do want to thank you for coming to my channel, for watching my videos, for supporting me, for being the most wonderful people writing the most wonderful comments. I just really, really enjoy doing this because of you, because of the interaction that we have. It makes it so much fun. And and all the requests that you make, my goodness, it's wonderful. All the different groups that I've been introduced to and singers and stuff, and it's like, it, it's just incredible. It really is. I also want to remind you that I always put the links to the artists in the description field so that you can follow them on social media and subscribe to their YouTube channels. And if you like their music, you can buy their music. So the bonus video today is, I know one that the uh, my Russian viewers are going to like and many others, Diana Ankudinova singing Polyushka Polya, which means Polyushka Field. I'm going to give a Hmm.
You know, when I think about what happened in World War II, there were so many people so many people that were killed it was unbelievable millions and millions and millions of people and the Russians paid a heavy price uh, a heavy heavy price in that war and yes you know things went south with communism and it was bad for a while um, but there's no denying the sacrifice that Russians made in World War II. And it was just a, it was, it was a, a horrendous war. World War I was even worse. If you've, if you've done any research at all about World War I, that was just a slaughterhouse. It was an absolute slaughterhouse. It was horrible. How anyone survived that mentally intact is beyond me. Uh, but World War II was, I guess, what we would call the first modern war with uh, tanks and heavy machine guns far more superior to what they had in World War I and, and what we call killing machines, aircraft, and every kind of lethal weapon you can imagine and I would imagine there's a lot of Russians that go out to fields like that one and think about what could have been about the brothers and nephews and sons that they lost to that war and other wars after that too You know, it would be wonderful if we could just get rid of war completely. Just totally eliminate it. But it doesn't seem like it's possible. Especially not when we have leaders all over the world who are so eager to start wars so they can make money. And I wish that there were some way that we could find a way as a world, as an entire world, to just get along and cooperate. But there's always somebody who wants to muck up the works. Now that I'm done philosophizing, um, when, when Diana sings in that low voice, man, that is so thick and syrupy and, oh, it just uh, gets under my skin. It's it's sexy beyond belief. Uh, oh, it just uh, it, you have to listen to it to really get it. It's like yum. And she has a beautiful soprano voice. There's no question about that. But I think the the place where she uh, stands out from the crowd where she is completely different is in that lower range when she gets down there her voice just thickens up and gets very very viscous and it is completely unique completely unique this was a song that uh, someone asked or mentioned in a comment at one time and i i took a note on it and said ah, maybe i'll do this someday and here we are and interestingly enough <laughs> Uh, on my list of requests for today, I have five songs that are requested, and the first three of them are Russian songs. So we're going to be heavy on the Russians today. So I thought for my second bonus video, I would do something completely off the wall and different. <laughs> I'm just feeling frisky today, okay? So anyway, that was Diana on Kunadinova. And before I sign off from this one, I do want to pray for you. Thank you for coming to my channel and pray that you will have an abundant life, that you will live a long time, that you'll be healthy, that God will keep you safe from harm, 
and that you will be born again if you're not already. I, I pray for the same thing for every single person that you love. And more than anything, more than anything in the world, I pray that you will be anxious for nothing. But in all things, through prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, you will make your requests known to God. And the peace that passes all understanding will keep your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. This is the Vietnam Era Vet, out.